What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Third Person. This is the Third Person Podcast. My name is Chris, and with me, as always, is my buddy Mike. What's going on? What's up, Mikey? So, guys, we're going to do some Season 3 character theories for you, right out of our brains, aren't we, Mikey? Yes. <laughs> yes, absolutely. Um, I think that we've been getting some uh, some comments, too, in our Badlands videos. A lot of people wanted to talk about this, uh, this, this series. It's gained a lot of steam, um, don't you think? You know, I it's do. Got- gotten a lot uh, i think it's gotten a lot more viewers this season because um overall it's, it was a great season Cause, so because it's a dope show man like, it is it's it's really good so uh we just wanted me and chris just wanted to kind of break down where each character possibly can go um in season three what we might get from them what kind of ideas uh we were kicking around so we decided to do a cool little badlands video so we're gonna break down each character um pretty much where we left off with 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 them some of them will group together um, so we just feel like uh, having a little fun and kicking a cool little theory video uh, out for you guys. Yeah. So uh, let's just uh, let's get started with what we think. Yes, sir. You want to get into? Uh, we'll 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 start with Tilda and Odessa since we saw them last after dropping off Baji. Oh, these uh, women. These Great. two lovers, <laughs> lovers they are. Um, obviously, where we left off, um, Tilda was 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 injured, still beaten pretty pretty bad by her mother. Um, that and they so leave. Bad. Yeah, I know, right? And they drop uh, Baji off, and they take off in the truck. So I'm not going to get too crazy in where I think they're going, because obviously I'm not sure. But there are a lot of empty places and empty mansions lying around the Badlands That's since true. we don't have many barons left. But I can see, um, I can see Tilda with the love that she has for MK, um, and making sure that that he's safe. I can kind of wait and see when she's healed. They kind of, uh, kind of figure out a plan and a way to get, um, to get MK back to help Sonny. You think so? Yeah. I mean, I kind of feel the same. I think they're going to try and find Sonny to help MK, but here's the thing. I think two, two things about Odessa. Yeah. She's a bad influence on Tilda. Number one. And yeah, <laughs> it's going to cause a, it's going to cause a problem between them because Tilda Tilda's not going to listen to her about MK and she and yeah. Odessa hates MK and thinks yeah. that he did all that shit on purpose and enjoyed it. So that's yeah. going to be I I bet you and 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 unfortunately I think it might be kind of a boring aspect of it the same way yeah. that MK and his little teacher girl, I forget her name. Uh Evie. Ava. Eve, Ava. Ava. That's yeah. all I hear every time I think of it. Says, <laughs> what do you think Ava? So I, how that was like the probably the weakest point of the season. I yeah. think Tilda Odessa are going to have it out. Uh, it's going to be at least one or two episodes that they're going to be like, well, I don't want to go find him. He's a monster. And she's like, he's my friend. Yeah, I can As see that too. I can see that too. I mean, I can also see because now um, Odessa did have this. Um, she had, she knew she's known about MK, right? So if she was on this ship, how else would she have known about MK slaughtering all these people? Right. If she wasn't there herself or she didn't learn this information from somebody that no, was No, she was there. there. She said it. She they was on the, the ship, fl- right? She said she watched, she watched him do it or she saw right, what so he then, did. Yeah. Why didn't he kill her? You know, I think there's still something a little iffy about yeah. um, what yeah, exactly we're going, happened. Yeah, I think we're going to find yeah. out something. But, yeah, but, uh, you know, not the not the hottest um, couple, hottest characters on the show or our favorite characters, but interesting enough to see where, where, they, where they go uh, yeah. in season three. Absolutely, yeah. absolutely, but yeah. So yeah, so 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 yeah. So I think we're gonna, we agree they're gonna try and maybe go try and help MK. Sunny Get MK's MK ass. Something. Yeah, something like that. Yes. Yeah. All right. Yes. Uh, what? Uh, so so you want to head over to where do you want to go? You want to go to Sunny? Yeah, right, let's shoot over to, to Sunny. Sunny, my lad. All right. So Sunny and 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 Henry. So Sunny's got Henry. Yes. Uh, we talked about this a little bit at the end of the season finale. We had a little couple ideas on theories. Um, mm-hmm. I think that. Sonny is going to go after MK because the widow wants MK. Yeah. So she, so he's going to go after her. But what does he do with Sonny? I mean, Henry. With little Henry. Little Henry. You know, he <laughs> saved Lydia's uh, life. So, yeah. uh, you know, again, I think yeah. we said this. <laughs> I think you're going the same route that I'm going with this. Yeah. yeah. He's going to, I think he's going to pass off Henry to Lydia. Yeah, and the then go Manny after Roll MK. Or something, yeah, right? So, and 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 to go a step further, I think we said that they're going to find an like another empty mansion. Yeah, I was actually I actually wrote down it would be interesting to see um, 
you know, first of all, uh, Sonny's going to want Henry in the safest place possible, at least right off the bat, you know, get him, get him away from where, you know, Quinn's subway palace kind of a thing. So underground tunnel thing. So I thought it would be interesting if um, Sonny goes back to the roots where Quinn's overgrown mansion um, mm-hmm. could possibly be. And by going to Quinn's place, I think maybe Lydia may have had the same idea and that's where he actually bumps into Lydia again. And that's where they kind of yeah, yeah. make the, you know, and that's where they can actually make the deal. Um, I said this um, in our discussion of the finale of season two that it was bittersweet in a way because obviously we lost Vale, but I don't want to see Sonny as um, broken. You know, we, we lo- well, we love Sonny as a fighter. I think we'll definitely see brokenness from him, but just to be like that single dad, how is Sonny going to be able to do everything when he has an infant on his shoulder all the time? You know what I mean? Yeah. So I think he definitely needs someone that he can trust. I believe he can trust Lydia. We saw how much Lydia cared for Henry when um, when the veil vale was alive uh, in you know in Quinn's um, underground kind of tunnel system thing there. So I definitely see something a meet up with them and Lydia have this nanny role. What about? What I I agree. I think that's what they'll yeah. do. But what if they did a what if they did a season three Rick Grimes, right? Where they have okay. Sonny just not fight anymore because he did lose his he did lose his his love, but he has his kid, and he now he just wants to protect his kid, and he doesn't want to leave him. You see, now that's the other thing. If you think about yeah. it, he could be, they could go the route where, well, no, I'm not leaving this kid. I just found out about him. I just rescued him. His yeah. mom's dead. I don't trust anybody, even Lydia. So they could, I mean, it won't last for long because he'll get mm-hmm. dragged back. Someone either, what if Tilda and Odessa find Sonny and say, you have to go help MK. And then he goes, fine. And maybe he yeah. leaves him with her. Well, I mean, with them. You never know. I'm just saying, but well, I think they might. What if I think they might? They just might in the beginning try to keep him as a single dad, because think about it. His in his mind, he just found his son. Why the hell would he leave him? He's like, I'm not leaving this kid anyway. Hey, yeah, no. He straps I, him I, to his back on the bike <laughs> and he goes and he. T- yeah, you know? he does a Michonne with um, exactly with yeah. Judith on the on you know the backpack yeah, thing. But yeah. I can you know what I agree to to uh, to an extent, but we do know. Um, you know, now going through two seasons with the characters, the kind of bonds that Sonny has with MK and stuff like that. Um, even though he did lose Vale, I don't necessarily think he's going to be the broken type, the de- the, the depressed type. I think it's going to be like a redemption no, not, thing. Not or... depressed, but but even if they just made it so that he didn't leave the kid and he just wanted to be with his kid. I don't. I don't think. I definitely think that Sonny's going to go after MK. Um, like I mean, so do I. I'm just, I'm just trying to throw, you know, play devil's, yeah. devil's advocate and be like, yeah. what if they went that route? That, yeah. you know, I don't I mean, think it would last long. I don't think. Yeah, I, I honestly think that it's going to be more of let's go after, um, you know, here's Lydia. Hell, maybe he brings Henry with him. Who knows? Hey, yeah. It could. <laughs> let me just, know. let me just set you down while I take care of business real quick. Stay here, know? buddy. Watch Daddy and learn. Yeah. Right? So, uh, you know, I guess we'll, we'll find out, but I definitely think that Sonny's going to go. Try to get the gang back together. You yeah, know true, what I mean? True. Okay, cool. Yeah. Uh, what's next? Let's get into, let's uh, kind of put Widow, uh, MK, Waldo kind of together since we see them um, at okay. the, the Widow's Mansion kind okay, of a thing. sounds good. All right, so our next uh, group, let's group into, you know, Waldo, MK, and the Widow. Um, I can see, I wrote down... Uh, in, in in a big star here, like a big underlying thing that you know. Asterisk. What did what did Widow want from Baji? The Widow wanted Baji to decipher Translate. the book. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Um, as soon as she finds out that Baji's gone, the book is gone. I think it's going to kind of be a full court press. Let's go after Baji wherever he may be, and let's get this book back. I feel like this is super super important to to the Widow. I think that's pretty obvious. So by doing that. Um, sending out the butterflies, if not herself, going on these missions to kind of find him. I can see it's possible that MK may be able to slip off on his own. I don't, I'm not a thousand percent with that one, but I can actually see um, if we are right with the whole Sunny thing that maybe while the widow's gone, Sunny, some of these people can come in and kind of go on a rescue mission um, to get MK 
um, or I, you know, or maybe even Tilda. You know, I, I'm assuming that next season is definitely going to be a big rescue mission for MK. Um, by whom, it, not exactly who knows, but I definitely think that he'll be um, scooped up somehow um, relatively quick with uh, within season three. Wait, what if Waldo helps him escape? That's a possibility too, and that's what I also wrote down. Um, remember, the widow gave um, Waldo an option. Hey, listen, kind of help me out. You always wanted to be a baron. There's a lot less barons running around. I think Chow might be the only one, or there might be yeah, one. Yeah, they killed everyone. One. Yeah. Um, so there's a lot of open houses. It's something that Waldo, I'm sure, always wanted. The widow said that herself. So um, will he take this? You know, let me ask you that. Uh, quick do you think he would take that kind of a deal is he enticed enough to say screw everybody else um you know myself i don't think so because we saw the kind of fondness that he had for tilda so as soon as he has that um information about what the widow had done to to tilda i can see like you said maybe he will maybe he will help mk um i think you know you just you just hit you just hit a point because yeah, I don't think he'll take a barony, but also once he yeah, does find out about that, is that could be the catalyst for him helping MK escape. Yeah, he could be like, "Well, damn it, I just keep working for psychopaths, so I'm gonna leave." Maybe he leaves with them, and they all meet up with Sonny. Yeah, you I never think know. This, maybe yeah. Waldo, maybe Waldo and MK travel together. Maybe this is maybe in the in the first half of this season is just everyone paired off in like traveling to a point. Yeah, remember we're getting sixteen episodes. Holy uh, crap, that's right. Yeah, they're going to yeah. do that then. Then they're definitely going to do that because yeah. they need filler. So yeah. you're going to have a Tilda Odessa episode. You're going to have a Sonny Henry episode. You're going to have a Waldo MK episode. Most likely. <laughs> so Widow, likely. and then you're going to have a Widow going after um, Beji episode. Yeah. Right? So we think that the Widow is going to go after Beji. You know, it's, it's that simple. She she wants that book. She's going to go after him. She's going to look for him. She yeah. may even know about that tower. We don't know who knows. It's, it's true. You tell yeah. me that's the only person that's ever come across that tower. It's out in the open. It's not like it's hidden. You don't yeah. think someone would have been like, I'm going to travel the coast because it's very pretty. And then all of a sudden see this huge tower and be like, all right. what? You can see it. It's on the top of a, of a, a mountainside, a, a cliffside. Yeah. You're going to see that's, I don't think my wife's laughing at me. I think she's laughing at something <laughs> she's watching. Um, you know what I mean? So I, yeah. I don't believe that she's the only one. Maybe no one knew what to do with that. But she's definitely he's definitely not the only one to have known yeah. about those. So, yeah, no, I can I can I agree with that. Uh, 100%. So I think I think that's where I think that's what's gonna go down with those guys, you know? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Um, you want to get into uh, Baji? While we're talking about it, yeah, sure. Why not? Let's get to him. Okay, so Beji, he. Okay, so do we think right off the bat? Do you think he's dead? Yeah. Do you think he's gonna die? I do not think he's going to die. Do you think uh, the widow is going to find him and help him? Do you think the widow's going to help him? Do you think that he's sitting no. out? He's dying, no. essentially. No. Well, well and... remember, uh, remember, you know, he knew he seemed she to know him. exactly. She needs him. I don't think that she would. She's going to be the one that helps him heal. I think what who whomever it may be that that heals Baji is going to be someone who receives Ex- this signal. Okay. Someone, um, l- listen. Baji seemed to know exactly what to press, exactly where to place. Well, he uh, he he went along yeah, with the book. The book had the yes, the answer, yeah. but it seemed how very it, yeah. exact. Yeah, it seemed very exact to me. Um, so whomever he's reaching with with this signal that we saw uh azra if they're we don't know who these people are we don't know if they're people we don't know we don't know anything about azra yet right we just kind of got you know our, our feet wet into um that this place is 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 real right um so i kind of had i wrote this down listen um i'll kind of shoot through it quick i wrote we're gonna learn a lot more about baji baji and his past I think we're going to learn um, kind of get deeper into his character. Cause we've, we see that being the trend in, mm-hmm. in the second season. Yeah. Um, I wrote on um, uh, the, perhaps the people from Azra will be the one that heals him. Um, and remember Baji has the compass in the book. So the compass belonged to Sonny. The book 
kind of belongs to the widow MK kind of thing. So mm -hmm. he's definitely going to be an important part of this. And he had one of the coolest uh, ending scenes, you know, in, in, in the season anyway. Yeah. I thought it was probably one of the most more interesting um, parts of the story that I'm going to be looking forward to now in season three. So I'm kind of excited about Baji, but I definitely will see a big reunite, um, uh, a lot, big reunion with, with, with Sonny, with Baji, with MK, however long that will take. Um, I mean, like I said, it's 16 episodes. Together, yeah. yeah, exactly. It's 16 episodes. So is it going to be a build up? Are we going to get a lot of, all right, let's go after him. Let's go after him. Let's get a couple pieces together. And finally, the end, you know, the mid-season premiere, finale, whatever yeah, that we're gonna be. get. Th we're definitely getting that. We're gonna get eight and eight. Yeah, probably. yeah. Um, so, you know, I I'll definitely see more of, of Baji, and most likely by the end of the season, um, maybe they'll be leaving the Badlands for good and heading to Azra itself. And my kind of my theory is that by the end of season three, maybe. Um, they'll come and we'll actually see that building in real life. That... I think, I think they moved this show pretty quickly. And even though you there's going to be, be 16, yeah. you never know, dude, they may do half a season of getting there. And then, they, and then the other half of the season there, it you could know, be because I, look, mean... I know, you know, this isn't a show. I can't see this a show. Like they, they want this to go for 10 seasons. I mean, as, no, as good as it is no, and everything, they, no. they probably have an ending in sight and we don't know what it, it could be four or five seasons. It could be yeah. six. Yeah, you know they could end it next season. We don't know, but the, no, you know, I agree. The, the point is, is that I think I think they're they're looking the way they're doing it is they're looking, mm -hmm. especially now with these extra these extra episodes. They have a chance to move it along even further and do some yeah. not necessarily time jumps, but like I said, mid season end it where they're going to get there, and then and then they come back in the in the mid season, you know, the next mid. Yeah. Uh, second half and it's and it's and they're there or you know what i'm saying like i totally can see them doing that yeah. um yeah i don't you know i i guess i you're, just I think, I, you're, I think you're a little bit more optimistic than i am well you know what um, it is about I how think... quick it'll go i mean hey i'd like to i mean i agree with you the show is definitely fast paced but now that we have six more episodes to make up a season i can see maybe them taking a bit more time i mean amc but now we have a lot of that. characters though you see it, it's true. We have more characters that we're invested yeah, well, Walking in. Walking Dead has a lot of characters too, and, and we look see how long that takes. Control. Exactly. Look how long that takes. You know, I don't think it'll necessarily be as slow as 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 some of those. No, I don't think so. But, getting, but you know what's in what's exciting is that this show. I didn't expect this show to go into this realm. Mm -hmm. You know where? Wow, we're going to find out a, more about what happened in the past. Like I like that. I think it's great. Yeah. I think it's great that we're seeing this world and this land and what happened and outside the Badlands and. Mm -hmm. I mean, I think it's great, and I'm looking forward to it. I'm, I'm, I'm excited to see what kind of catastrophe happened in, in this universe, and and like I'm just really excited that this is where the show is going. They didn't just leave it as, oh, it's this martial arts thing, you know. They've 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 woven this all this fighting and stuff into an actual story, um, yeah. and I like it. I think that's great. I think that that something creating something like this has longevity it has it's got legs it has yeah. it keeps interest it's like oh i want to it's like lost a lot of people dropped off a loss but a lot of people stuck around because it was like i need to find out what the hell this thing mm. is it's like you're invested that long yeah you know so i think i think they're doing great i think you know i mean yeah they had some wonky episodes some dumb character stuff and yeah but but you know yeah. what though there's a cheese factor about it and there and th this show doesn't i don't think this show takes itself too seriously I think they wear what they are on their sleeve and they're proud of what they're doing because I mean, no other show has, has been able to, I mean, not, I mean, not that I have ever really seen and I've seen mm -hmm. a lot of TV and movies, but I yeah. don't think any other show has been this like other than like maybe in like Hong Kong or, or, or Korea or something like that where they, where these things is, this is, it's normal to produce something like this. Their whole team is a Hong Kong stunt team. You know what I mean? So it's like, this is the real deal, you know? So if for something on TV, I think it's great. And like I said, it's got legs. And I, 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 yeah. I feel like the story, if they just continue down this path, at, as slow as they want to go, as fast as they want to go, as long as we're getting some good world-building stuff, I think it's going to be good. Now, um, just to kind of move this along real quick, I have two yeah. things I have two things I want to question you about. Question yeah. you about? Yeah. Put you under the <laughs> microscope there, Mike. Oh, okay. yeah. Uh, no real problem. quick, just a quick, what do you think happened with Jade? Because the last thing we saw was the widow 
attacked her mansion and then I, that's yeah. it we didn't really see anything we don't we haven't seen we've n- heard neither hide nor hair from yeah her, from well her. listen i mean obviously quinn's gone that was probably enemy number one on her list um enemy number two ding 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 who do you think that is you it's know the widow. the widow yeah um we don't necessarily know how many um, clippers or cogs or whatever you want. All to call of them. them, yeah, they all are, are really with her right yeah. now. I'm sure she They're has all a running handful. Away. Of, yeah. So, like I said earlier, there there are a lot of places um, that are now barren. Um, no pun intended. No pun intended because of the barons all being, uh, most of them being killed. So I definitely think that there are. Uh, many places for Jade to hide out. I definitely think that we're going to see her again. Revenge. I, so you're saying revenge. It's going to be revenge is on, is on her plate. Revenge huh? for sure. Okay, yeah. cool. So she'll pop up somewhere, maybe least expected. Perhaps some of our other Try characters. Try to make alliances with someone. Yeah. You know what? See, now that it's saying saying that about Jade, wouldn't it be interesting if she kind of bumps into Tilda and Odessa? That could be something. You know? Um, or Lydia. Or, yeah, or even Don't that's forget, true, Lydia yeah. did go to her. That's true. And she helped Jade find. She's the one that helped Jade find um, Quinn. Quinn. So yeah. they're not on the outs, so they could hook yeah, up. No. And then it's she's true. got, and then they could help Sonny yep. with the baby. Sunny. I don't know. Now you're thinking. Yeah. But I mean, so yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. So I just wanted a quick little thing. And finally, real quick. Yes. What do you. You mentioned it uh, a second ago about. Mm. Basically, most of the barons are wiped out. What do you think yeah. the state of the world is in now? At least the Badlands. I mean, what do you feel about that? Dude, there's no barons well, left. Chow, I think Chow might be the only one left. I think well, some of our she, viewers yeah, had said Chow once we, we had made that comment. And I think yeah. someone was like, well, Chow's alive or whatever. So, I mean, dude, th- this at least the Badlands is like... They, yeah. Look at what they've done, Mikey. They've set it up so that the Badlands mm-hmm. is now... There's Open. nothing... Everything is messed up. The, the oil fields, we don't need to be in the Badlands anymore, do we? Well, I mean, it's it's definitely a viable place to be with all the... There's also a power uh, vacuum now. Now there's nobody ex- left. There's not very many, exactly. And the, widow so, is, doesn't, and the Widow probably doesn't have the Badlands on her mind. Like you said, like we've been saying, she wants that book, and now she's it's, she's yeah. been close. She's closer to Ozzer than she's ever been. Yeah. So. Well, I mean, they each have kind of control of certain areas, you know. Um, uh, what was it? The um, what's her name? The other, the last Baron, Chow. Chow. Now, Chow had her clippers and things like that. Were trying that that were um, what were they? Kind of slaving people that were yeah, trying yeah, to yeah, escape yeah, yeah. and all this kind of thing. You know, the widow has the oil fields now. You know, so it seems like each barony has their own right but without without these other barons who's now maybe you know it'll the power will grow you know maybe they'll take over more stuff and you're gonna need i mean without anybody running these places how are you gonna get the materials how are you gonna trade i'm sure there was trading involved and all these kind of things between the between these barons before everybody was slaughtered so there will be um there could be some fallout that way you know This one won't get the oil. This one won't get uh, flour, or you know what I mean. Well, whatever, you know what whatever is, they may be trading. You know what it so. is. You're gonna have people stepping up into the new, yeah. into being new barons, and you like you said, now there's yeah. gonna be that. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be yeah. some political stuff, like it was yep. back in the first season. I think. I think we're gonna get yeah. into some more, some more of that stuff. So, all right, look, I think we've rambled on enough about all this stuff. Um, yeah. I mean, there's probably plenty more we can come up with, but you know what? I think we'll leave it there. And yeah. uh, you know, guys. Please let us know what you think. Um, exactly. we're, we're happy you guys like the show as much as we do. We've said it mm-hmm. before. We want to thank you again for hanging out with us that whole season, season two of Into the Badlands, and checking out this video. And uh, again, let us know what you think. Absolutely. Don't forget to uh, check us out, obviously, on Third Person Pod. That's how we got this information from you guys in the first place, that you wanted us to kind of do a little Badlands video. A lot of We got a lot of um, what what the heck is going on with Baji kind of a thing. So yeah. um, just, you know, I agree with, with all you guys, and that's probably the most intriguing part of the end of the Season 2 uh, finale for me, so I'm excited to see that. But, of course, check us out on the Instagram, Third Person Pod, on iTunes as well facebook leave your comments and of course on youtube at third person pod yep that's it guys uh you know the spiel retro squad.com comic blitz yes. promo code you see it down there you, you guys already know it 
Uh, and if you don't, go watch another video of ours. Thank you so yeah. much, guys. <laughs> we'll see you on the next episode of Third Person Podcast. Thank you so much. We love you. Peace out. Peace.